To paraphrase the classic movie, we're back. The 14th season of Quiz Kids starts now. It's the Bay Area Quiz Kids. And now, the best host on the West Coast, Brad Friedman. Hi everybody, welcome to Quiz Kids. Thanks for joining us as we do begin our 14th season with a tournament style competition featuring some of the brightest high school kids from around the Bay Area. The teams will each compete twice and the top eight teams will come back to us for our final rounds. Today we're going to start with two terrific teams. I'll introduce them to you now. First we have the Archbishop Reardon Crusaders. <laughs> And they're taking on the Westmore Rams. Yeah. Welcome, teams. So we'll play our first round, the three for all. I'll ask a five-point toss-up question. The team that answers correctly gets control of that round. You will get a second question. If you answer that correctly, after collaborating, you can earn 10 points. A third question correct will earn you 25 points. Good luck to both teams. Here's the first toss-up. The answers are Hearst Castle, Buckingham Palace, and the White House. The question is, Dublin's Leinster House served as a model for what building designed by James Dospel? The White House. That is correct, by James Hoban. Here's your next question. Who was the first president to use the, white, the name White House on official correspondence? Roosevelt. Teddy Roosevelt. Theodore Roosevelt. Theodore Roosevelt. That is right. For 25 points, a complete gut and remodel was done on the White House during the term of which president? Truman. Truman. You got 25 points. Here's your next toss up. Isobars, isotherms, and isometrics. Which of these three is not found on a standard weather map? Trevor. Isobars? No, I'm sorry, that's incorrect. You can get the answer. Isometrics. Isometric. Isometric. Right. For 10 points on the weather map, isotherms connect Places with what identical measurements? Tem temperatures. temperatures. Temperature? Correct. Okay. A recent revision of weather data has declared the hottest temperature ever recorded in the world to have occurred in Death Valley, not on what North African country? Nigeria. Uh, the correct answer is Libya. Your toss-up answers are Disneyland, Magic Mountain, and Knott's Berry Farm. If you directed a cabbie to go to 1313 Harbor Boulevard in Anaheim, he would take you to which? Jason. Disneyland. That's right. You can tell by its name that Anaheim was settled by immigrants from what country? Anaheim. Germany. Correct. And for 25 points, the Salt Lake Bees and the Orem Owls are to form clubs that belong to what major league baseball team? The Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim. That is correct for 25 points. Here's your next toss up. Juno, Fairbanks, and Nome. What Alaska city is home to the finish line of the Iditarod? Clarissa. Juno. No, I'm sorry, you can steal. Fairbanks. That's right. The Iditarod traditionally starts on the first Saturday of March in which other Alaska city? Juno. No, Anchorage. The Coast Guard, the Marine Corps, or the Navy? Its officer training academy is in New London, Connecticut. Which U.S. service is responsible for search and rescue missions? It's, yes, Trevor. Um, the, the Coast Guard. Correct. Search and rescue missions at sea. It's the mm. Coast Guard. Colorado Springs, Colorado is home to which service academy? The Air Force. Right. Which is the only service academy to, locate it, to be located in a state capital? Um, yeah, uh, the Navy in Annapolis, Maryland. Uh, that's correct for 25 points, the Naval Academy in Annapolis. <laughs> the next answers are William Henry Harrison, James Buchanan, and John Quincy Adams. Who won the 1840 presidential election? Trevor. John Quincy Adams. No, but died after only 30 days in office. Harrison. That is correct. Another U.S. president was also named Harrison. What was his first name? Benjamin. Benjamin. Correct for 10. Following the death of Wayne Henry Harrison, who became the first vice president to assume the presidency following the death of the president? Johnson. 
No, it was John Tyler. A vacuum cleaner, a sewing machine, a dishwasher. Which piece of household and industrial machinery was pioneered by Elias Howe and Isaac Singer? Jason. A sewing machine. That's correct. The lock stitches, the most common sewing machine stitch, one thread, is carried in this needle, and the other comes from what school underneath? It is the bobbin. We'll take a break. We'll be back to meet the teams in just a minute. Bay Area Quiz Kid. And now it's time to meet the Quiz Kids. Once again, here's Brad. Welcome back. Let's say hello to the Westport team. Brandon Wynn, you're a sophomore, and you are an active member in the school's guitar club. Now, sometimes musician clubs on campus can be a little annoying, everyone walking around strumming together. What do you do to make campus life more pleasing at Westmore? Um, sometimes we do uh, lessons for the less experienced guitarists, and mm -hmm. sometimes we do open mic so people can perform and share their talent. Good. People can celebrate the talent that you all have and improve on that for the newcomers. Good. Clarissa Chan, you're a senior. And uh, last year, you had a chance to study abroad in Switzerland. That must have been exciting. Yeah. Where did you go and what did you do? I went to Geneva and I also went to like the Gruyere factories and the chocolate factories. So you, you studied the important stuff, cheese and yes. chocolate. <laughs> Excellent. I'm glad that education is taking us to great places. Das Ball Abiek. I got it. <laughs> Sophomore, um, you are Mongolian and got to take a trip to Mongolia for a month last summer to visit family. What is Mongolia like? Oh, it's really nice. Um, well, it was warm for the first main part. Um, I just got to see a lot of my family members that I haven't seen for a while and see, do some sightseeing. Including the world's largest statue of Genghis Khan, you yes, said. Yes. How exciting. Yeah, it was pretty scary because he's mounted on a horse. And from the on from the horse's head is like a viewing point. So this is fabulous. So yeah. it's like the Statue of Liberty, but yeah. Genghis Khan and a horse. Let's leave it there yeah. and give you guys a chance to score some points. Okay, you can take the lead. I have three categories, seven questions in each category, worth ten points. If you answer all seven questions correctly, you will score an additional thirty point bonus. Today's categories are ta ta, the end is near, and the end. Which category would you like? Yeah. The end is near. The end is near. The end is near. The end is near. All right. Name these words that contain the word end in them. Okay? It means to take a cust uh, suspect into custody. Apprehend. Apprehend. Correct. It means to make a change to something such as the Constitution. Amend. Amend. Correct. It's to grasp mentally. Like, do you understand? Comprehend. Comprehend, yeah. Comprehend. That's right. It's a bonus paid by a company to its stockholders, often on a quarterly Dividend. basis. Dividend. Correct. This music term means a gradual increase in loudness. Crescendo. Crescendo. Correct. Poe knows this swinging lever regulates the speed of a clock mechanism. Bend. Bend. No, as in his story, The Pit and the Pendulum. And finally, this Indiana city is home to the College Football Hall of Fame. Bend. 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 It's South Bend. You got five correct. Congratulations. <laughs> you took the lead, but let's see how Reardon does. Let's meet our gentlemen from Reardon. You're all seniors, and we'll start with Jason Serafica. Jason, you, like the other members of your team, do some very unusual and interesting things outside of school. You have an odd hobby about you work with wires to do what? Oh, yes. My gra I have my grandma to thank me for lending me her tools. I sort them together and try to fix them back up. That way I can revive my old VHS and watch old videotapes. Yes, but for most of them, you said you actually create something very specific with these wires that you gathered. Oh, I'm I use them to fix my fencing gear. Yes, you use it to fix fencing gear. So, on guard, dude. <laughs> Trevor Peralta. Yes. You do something unusual as well. What do you do? Well, you know, after a long day of, you know, being at school or being on Quiz Kids, I like to go in my garden and, you know, there, you, there's just, you know, peace. You reach your zen moment. And also you get to grow a lot of foods that you yourself can eat, which is organic and healthy. And, this is a um, great setup. 
yeah. for what you really do, which is you make Adobe bricks. Yeah, exactly. Well, I actually learned that talent um, from some family members, and it helps with the charity work that I do for Habitat for Humanity. Oh, fantastic. Well, a good plug for Habitat for Humanity, a great group. Anthony Filaretto, you, was, you are a police explorer, so you are interested in a career as in law enforcement, yep. and you get to ride with the police or work with the police. Mm -hmm. Tell us what you do. Uh, basically, like you have the opportunity to go on ride-alongs and things. Uh, you get to do a lot of community work, so you get to put yourself out in the community and make connections, and it's a real benefit so you can put your foot in the door in the career the love of law enforcement. A very important career. I hope it all works out for you. Thank you. Gentlemen, you have a chance to uh, get back your lead, choosing a category between Tata and the end. The end. The end. I wish that was something French, but no, it's actually uh, things that end with the letter Z. Johann Strauss was the king of them. Your answer? Mm. Tiffany. The Waltz. The it waltz. ends with a Z. This Pittsburgh company is known for its 57 varieties. Heinz. Correct. It's, it's Russia's third managed space program, still going more than 30 years after its first launch. Answer? No. It's the Soyuz. This strategically important strait connects the Persian Gulf with the Gulf of Oman. The Suez Canal. No, it's the Hormuz. It's a word from Yiddish meaning clumsy person. Hot. That's right. It's one cycle per second. Hurt. Correct. And finally, it's an adjective that means artificial or synthetic. Hirsatz. Ersatz is correct, and that is four correct. You have the lead at 195. We'll be right back with more Quiz Kids. And now we're back with the second half of Quiz Kids. Take it away, Brad. Let's take a moment to give a round of thanks to the coaches for both teams. First, from Reardon, Mr. John Allback. And from Westmore, Mr. Alan Bronstein. Thank you, coaches. And now we will go back to the three for all, but the point values are raised, 10, 25, and 50 points. So you can really pull ahead. I will ask uh, the first toss-up question right now. The answers are Honey Boo Boo, Snooky, and Jay Wow. Watching her show is a guilty pleasure for many Americans. Which reality TV star's real name is Alana Thompson? Clarissa. Honey Boo Boo. You know that, huh? I do know that. America first met Honey Boo Boo on what alliter alliteratively named show? Tatia. Toddlers and Tears. Oh, you know so much. <laughs> Finally, for 50 points, airing on August 29, 2012, the ratings for the fourth episode of Here Comes Honey Boo Boo actually beat out Fox News' coverage of what event? Election? No, no, not the election. Um, Answer? The election. It was the Republican National Convention. <laughs> Next, toss-up. Iowa, Indiana, Illinois. Which state lies furthest to the east? Das Ball. Uh, Indiana. Correct. Four U.S. states begin with the letter I. Besides the three I just mentioned, what's the other one? Idaho. 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 That's correct. The name for what Indiana lake became part of the campaign slogan for William Henry Harrison? Said tip, tip a canoe. canoe. That is right for 50 points. <laughs> Derry, Galway, and Dublin. Blackpool is a broad, popular British seaside vacation spot, but the Gaelic for Blackpool also names what capital city? Yes, Trevor. Dublin. Right. The Book of Kells is a famous illustrated manuscript on display in the library of what oldest Dublin college? You can talk it over. What do you guys think it is? University of Dublin? No, it's Trinity College. <laughs> Archery, bowling, and curling. At the London Olympics, South Korea won the most gold medals in this sport. Archery. Tre that is right. Another film 
Uh, uh, this sport was uh, popularized in movies like Brave and The Hunger Games. Another film, Marvel's The Avengers, featured an archer. What was his name? Oh, Hawkeye. Hawkeye. Correct. Your parents might experience deja vu, deja vu uh, hearing the name Hawkeye, but they'd probably think of an army surgeon played by whom? <coughs> Uh, Anthony Trigero? No. <laughs> the actor Alan Alda played Hawkeye Pierce in the series MASH. Belgium, the Netherlands, and Denmark. Which European country is home to Shakespeare's Hamlet? Das Ball. Uh, Denmark. Correct. Which Caribbean nation is on the eastern part of the island of Hispaniola? Uh, Dominican Republic. Dominican Republic. Correct. Tourists sometimes confuse the Spanish-speaking Dominican Republic with what English-speaking island whose name is the Italian for Sunday? Sunday. Domingo? Oh, no. Domingo. Domingo? No, it's Dominica. Oh. Nylon, bakelite, and celluloid. Alexander Parks was the first to synthesize it in 1855. What first man-made plastic found one of its original uses in the manufacture of built... Cellulite. Celluloid uh, for billiard balls were made the manufacture of billiard balls. Celluloid film enabled the creation of what company whose early slogan was, you push the button, we do the rest? Kodak. That is right, Eastman Kodak. Nitrocellulose is formed from the reaction of cellulose and which acid? Hydrate. No, it was nitric acid. A U.S. senator, a California state senator, and a Canadian senator. Who can serve the longest term? Joss Ball. A California senator? That is incorrect. You can steal. I think it's a U.S. senator. Yeah, no, probably. A U.S. senator? No, it's a Canadian oh. senator. Persephone, Pandora, and Poseidon. Which figure from Greek mythology has a name meaning all gifted? Clarissa. Pandora. Correct. Which presidential candidate had a one-word slogan that also named the only thing left in Pandora's box? Answer? Um, no answer. The last thing left was hope, and that was Barack Obama. <laughs> Istanbul, Tehran, and Baghdad. What's the modern name of the city once known as Byzantium? Trevor. Istanbul. Many in Istanbul commute from continent to continent when they cross what street which bisects Istanbul? Ooh. Feel free to discuss. The Hellenic Street? No, that's not it. Uh, the Hellenic Street. It's the Bosporus. And that is the end of the round. We have 170 for Reardon and 205 for Westmore. We'll be right back with the final round. Don't go away. Welcome back, it's time for the final round. I will put three minutes on the clock. The questions are worth 30 points. The team member who buzzes incorrectly will earn the 30 points. If you buzz in incorrectly, the other team will get a chance to collaborate and steal. Good luck to both teams. Here's the first question. A conviction for tax evasion brought down what prohibition gangster? Yes, Al Trevor. That is right. It was cited on April 5th, 1722, also known as Rapa Nui. What do we call this island famous for its large stone statues? Das Ball. Mm, the Easter Islands. Correct. It has the same dimensions as its transpose. What do we call a matrix with equal numbers of rows and columns? The square matrix. It's 23 miles long, but less than two miles wide. Which loch is known for its supposed monster? Trevor. Loch Ness. Correct. A Paris opera house now stands on the site of this former fort. Which prison is the namesake? Yes, Das Ball. The Bastille. Yes, for the French national holiday, the Bastille. Not too long ago, it was dubbed the, Cel the Celtic or the Celtic Tiger. Enda Kenny is the prime minister of what European country? Ireland. Trevor? Ireland. Correct. They're powered by supermassive black holes. Name these distant energetic active galaxies whose name is the abbreviation of quasi-stellar radio source. Jason. Quasar. Correct. It changed hands following the Camp David Accords. The Suez Canal lies west of what Egyptian peninsula? Das Ball. Uh, Suez Canal. No, I'm sorry. You can steal. 
Sinai. The Sinai. Right. Yes. Maxwell's equations can be combined to derive it. What does special relativity say is the ultimate speed limit? Trevor. The speed of light. Right. Which rock type has intrusive and extrusive forms depending upon whether they were formed from magma or lava? Jason. Igneous. Correct. It's possessed by addition and multiplication, but not subtraction or division. What's the property that says A plus B equals B plus... Commutative. Plus A is right. It's found in Greek moussaka and in the vegetable eastern dip baba ganoush. What is this vegetable das ball? Uh, spinach. No, I'm sorry. Best known for having a purple skin. Oh, purple skin. Eggplant. That is right. Oh, yeah. It was founded in 206 BC. Name this dynasty the namesake of China's majority ethnic group. Jason. Han. Correct. Edmund Randolph was the first man to hold it. Janet Reno was the first woman. Name this top Justice Department post. Das Ball. Uh, chi Chief Justice. No, I'm sorry. Uh, you can steal. Uh, the Attorney General. His is the most famous pet in modern physics. In a famous thought experiment, whose cat... Pavlov. I mean, no, I'm uh, sorry, that's incorrect. Whose cat is both dead and alive? Schrodinger. Right. It's led by King Carl Gustav the 16th. Which country has sought extradition of... Yes, Das Ball. Sweden. Correct, of Julian Assange. He ordered the 1936 conquest of Ethiopia. Following his 1945 execution, yes, Das Ball. Mussolini. Yes, whose corpse was hung upside down at a gas station. That is the end of the game. 470 for Reardon, 355 for Westmore. Reardon, ring wins the game. Congratulations to Reardon High School. Well played, Westmore. We will see both of you in future matches. matches. Meanwhile, come back next week. We'll have two great more teams. So, bye-bye. Two great more teams.